Because as we cede, I'll call it control, of our decision making to machines, machines have to make what we would consider ethical decisions. Now, what's interesting about this is that machines don't have to be ethical. They just have to behave in ways that we find socially acceptable and ethical. And there are ways to, in, to incorporate that into the programming of the machines. Uh, the, we're going to see this right away in the, in the driverless cars, in the autonomous vehicles. You know, it, it can sense that there are five people in this corner and one person on that corner. It, it can't stop. It's got to do something. Should it kill you? Which is an interesting question as the single passenger of the car. Should it turn left? Should it turn right? Well, that's an ethical decision. It, not that we can't do it by machine but uh, we need to recognize this. The biggest risk, particularly as the, the people who are really working on this in the military, I'll give them real credit for this, they're not just going ahead with all this stuff without convening conferences full of uh, fuzzy-headed academics and you know, pundits and stuff, and they're really talking about this, and seriously, they do it really well. Uh, I know several of them. Uh, uh, you know, they're, really, they're really smart guys, and they're really thinking about this. The big problem that occurs is there's a disconnection between the person making the decision and the actual, uh, the person taking the action and the, per, and the device that's making a decision as to who to kill, let's say out in the field. So when you break this chain of responsibility, nobody's responsible for the fact that that automated gun just shot six children. You know, who's, who's responsible? These are real questions. Uh, there's a theory, I'm not a proponent of it, but it's re reasonable that, um, how do I put this, uh, that you shouldn't be making decisions as to who to kill unless you can feel remorse for your decision. So that's the kind of philosophical issues that people are concerned about.